seriously, game, you're sending a wandering horde after me at the end of Horde Night. What kind of bull crap is that? This is Horde Morning, you guys. In case you've never had a Horde Morning well, now you know what it looks like. Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and it is Horde Night 7. So, yeah, it is uh, about 7.30 in the evening, and uh, we are going to go back to the Horde base and do a couple finishing touches. I'm just grabbing a few more items out of here that we might need. And I have uh, a little bit of cornbread cooking up there. Uh, so our food's not terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Uh, so let's eat that egg, and what do we get? We get four. Yeah, let's just get everything topped off here. Uh, we also have a couple of points that we need to spend. So we'll do that when once we get to the horde base. Let's see, what was I going to do here? Oh, yeah, we'll put those jars back there. Um, these feathers can go in here. And I think we're about as prepared as we can be for horde night. So uh, let's get on over to the horde base. Uh, did I shut the the cook stove off? Yeah, I did. Okay. And then we will... Uh, I got a couple more quick things I need to do on the base. Um, well, actually, no, just one more thing I think that we need to do. Uh, and that is to put a light up. So I got the lantern. Uh, one of the lanterns with me. And then I think we'll pretty much be ready to go. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see how, how this goes tonight. Um, if this was vanilla, I wouldn't honestly be too concerned about it, but, uh, I don't know if the Undead Legacy Horde 7 is going to be more intense. I just honestly don't remember off the top of my head from when I did them before, uh, you know, how they were in the early game. Now, in the later game, they get pretty, pretty gnarly, uh, for sure. But in the early game, I just don't remember exactly what happens there. Oh, yeah, actually, you know what? There is another thing we need to do if we have the time to do it. Um, so I wanted to I wanted to finish clearing that stuff out of there. We don't strictly need to do that, but we, we really should if we can. Uh, but everything should be ready to go over here. Here's the way the horde base looks in the front. Um, and I want to put... I'm going to put this light on the top and see if it, you know, gives us enough light to do what we need to do. Um, I have some extra storage here, too. But let's just nerd pull up here. And I want to put this right... Um, I don't know how well that's going to work, actually. All right, let's do this. I'm certainly not expecting cops, so I don't think we need to worry about spit for tonight. So, so let's pick this back up. And what we're going to do... Let's jump down here is let's turn it can i can we do it on face there hmm it's probably not going to get hit there but it could all right um think 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 what if we What if we did this? Let's take this guy here and do the plate. And we're going to copy rotation. Stick that there. Let's upgrade it. And then we'll put the light. Oh no, shoot. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, all right, so if I do, okay, on face, I want, I want on face there. Is that going to stay there though? Yep, yeah, I guess it is. Well, that's odd. <laughs> the shadow that makes is odd. Okay, this will have to do. Um... I'm, you know, there's a better way I could do this, but we don't, we don't have time to mess with it for now. So it's going to have to do. 
Now, um, you know, I have these half blocks here, and all I have is a stone pickaxe, and I just don't have enough uh, skill yet to be breaking that stuff out. So um, it's going to be interesting in terms of just how I'm going to be able to reach the Zika Ruths. I think what I'm going to have to do is crouch. I mean, you know, hitting them with the bow's not going to be a problem. Their head's probably going to be right about here, so I should still be able to hit, like, with this. Um, but this... This might be interesting. We'll have to just see how, how that goes. We'll have to see how that goes. Okay, so uh, let's see here. We got yeah, we got a little tiny bit more time. Let's just jump back down here and see if we can break a couple more of these out before the Horde Knight starts. Oh, let, before we even do that, though, let's look at our, our skills. So I have two uh, perk points here. I want to put one of those into Sexual Tyrannosaurus. And I want to put one in... Oh, man, we can't do archery right now because we need a perception first, don't we? All right, you know what? We're going to do healing factor then. And then uh, then we'll, you know, we'll get a perception point going and an archery point going later. So I think that's what we're going to do. All right. That'll, uh, you know, uh, the first point in sexy T is going to help quite a bit. Um, in terms of, you know, just our stamina and that sort of thing for melee and all that. And let's see, we've got, I, I got some extra bone knives made up. I've got, um, we got a little, so here, let's put those bandages there. I've got some meds if we need them for certain things, four extra bone knives. And uh, I was going to, something else too. Oh, and 19 re primitive repair kits. We got some iron, we got some boards, we got some large stones, you know, for keeping things repaired. So. I, I think, you know, I feel reasonably good that I, I, I think we're, you know, fairly well prepared for this, considering, again, our very low level. Uh, I have managed to get, like, something like 20 levels in mining just from all the picking and and wood cutting that I've been doing, you know, to prepare for this. And as you can see, of course, it did take me the entire day to get all of that prep done. Uh, everything inside the structure here has been torn down. Uh, you know, so I got all that taken care of too. That way there's nothing that the Zeeks can stand on inside to try and reach up to the roof and, and, you know, do damage that way. So we should be, like I said, we should be pretty well prepared here to make this happen. So let's, uh, let's get the rest of this busted out and then uh, we'll get up topside and get ready for the Horde. All right, here we go. Horde Night 7 on Undead Legacy Season 2. Our first Horde Night of Season 2. Let's hope this goes well. Because <laughs> if it doesn't, well, then it won't. Right? Okay, path on up here. There you go. Come on, nurse. Oh, actually, you know what? That's... That's not a bad spot for their head. Oh, wow. Holy crap. Okay, we're going to have to be a little more careful if we wanted to survive this night. And they infected us? Oh, crap. Okay, well, let's get some bleeds on them. I, yeah, I need to stand back a little more, don't I? Doggone it. Okay, so we'll shoot her. She's dead. Um... Does this nurse have a bleed on her? Well, she does now. Okay. I need to get a bleed on you. There we go. Um, I put a, a bar up there, too, so they couldn't just climb through. Okay, we got to get rid of this crawling nurse because she's hitting us in the legs. Okay, she's dead. All right, let's get a, a bleed on you and refresh your bleed, depraved utility worker. A little club action, too. now oh we got tagged all right yeah we're gonna have to be careful about that let's um 
Yeah, we better take this now. Plus, that made our abrasion go down a little bit. All right, I'm thinking maybe a little more archery is in order here, because this is getting dangerous. It's kind of too bad now that we didn't take that other point in archery, huh? Wow, they really like to try and crawl through there, don't they? All right, since we have four of them, let's try something here. Can we catch them all on fire? No, it looks like that only catches the one on fire that I hit. It's not like a Molotov. Oh, you jumped right when I released the arrow. How dare you do that? All right, let's just use these up. It's just, like I said, it's a little bit dangerous for me to try and get in there um, with all of them like that because they're tagging me. All right, that's good. That's pretty good shape. I can't get to the outer one on there, but... All right, let's just dump a couple of them down. Oh, okay. Oh, off of your head. Okay, bleed on you. Okay, you fall down. You come over here so I can get a bleed on you. I have to really watch where I'm aiming with this to, you know, to not hit the block. Oh, we got tagged. Yeah, okay. Can't believe we got freaking infected again, man. We're going to have to go harvest some stumps for that. Okay, burn, baby. Light him up. Light him up, up, up. I'm trying to get in there and get some bleeds on him without getting hit myself. Okay, we got a bleed on him. Got a bleed on him. Get out of there. Okay. We got these flaming arrows as a reward from the trader. All right, let's check our blocks here. Get that one done. If I stand up, oh yeah, if I stand up, I can hit that one there too. Good. I kind of forgetting that I'm I'm crouched here. Your bows and crossbows have ins improved to level two. Nice. No, 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 no. Get a bleed and a burn going on you. Okay. Down with the sickness. Man, how many of these arrows do I have? Uh, three more. Okay. Um, all of them are burning, so let's wait till the burn gets done. Okay. Let's burn you. Oh, crap. <laughs> he dodged the arrow, man. All right, last burn arrow. Now we're back to uh, just normal arrows. Okay, you dropped a bag. Get me my arrows back. Get a bleed on you. And a conk on you. Oh! Ouch, ouch, ouch. Yeah, when they're... When they're down below like that, we just can't walk up there, man. It's too dangerous. So, archery's the name of the game when that happens. Can I get to here? Yeah, okay. That's a, I guess that's another way we could deal with that. Hold still, lady. Okay, let's get a bleed on. Oh! Now, now she's down. Okay. 
Yeah, that's how we deal with that. Okay, we just drop them down. Okay, let's do a quick thingy here. Everything is actually in pretty good repair overall. I wonder if they're probably hitting the the outside ones, but can't really get to them. Okay, that one's almost gone. Oh. Okay, he's dead, and he should be going down any second here. Let's get some bleed on you. Oh, what, what, what just happened? She, oh, I'll bet you she glitched in and then the game pulled her back. That's probably what happened there. Okay. Hey, Jiggly. Come join the party. There you go. Have a bleed. Okay, so, so far, not, not too bad. Okay. Get some, refresh your bleeds. And let's get some archery going again. Hit you. And, okay. Take this opportunity to do a little more touch-up. Yeah, these side ones, they're hitting them. So if we can touch them up just a smidge. Yeah, that one especially. Okay, good. We are actually not doing bad. Okay, come on, Steve. Have a bleed. Have a bleed in the face. Then it'll be nice when we get a better bow and... A little better skill in bows. Okay, give me my arrow back there. Yo. Zombie yo. Nope. No crouching. No crouching allowed. Okay, come on, nurse. Get it on over here. Have a bleed. Have another. And another, and another. Okay, she did. Everybody, there's a little bit of banging going on down below, but not too bad. Okay, he's dead. We do have the serrated blade mod on our knife, too, which has a chance of a bleed on a normal attack. Here, let's repair that. All right. Give me my arrow, Steve. And have a bleed. And another, and another, and another, and another. <laughs> I don't want to get too close just because our health's slow and I don't... Well, you know what, though? I have... Oh. You know what? I have pills. Yeah, duh. Take some pills, man. Take some pills. We have plenty of uh, water here to counter the thirst effect. And, uh, you know, I I took my tough guys off so we could get some XP, uh, which reduces, of course, our fortitude. Oh, wait, are we done? I think we might have killed the horde, you guys. Somebody's banging on something over here. All right. Since I'm not... Since I don't remember... Well, whether it's a remember or uh, Subquake changing the code or whatever, I'm not sure if when the horde's finished, it's finished on in this mod. I, I think it is, because it, it used to be, but, you know, again, I, it's been about a year or so since I played, and he's, there's been many updates, so... What I think I'm going to do for this first time, you guys, is I think I'm just going to stay here um, at least for a little while and see if, you know, what happens, if, if more hordies come or not. Okay, whoever that was just broke free of whatever they were hung up on, so let's kill, kill another Steve here. Okay. We'll give you a gut shot. And then a bleed. Ooh. 
clunk him a couple times with this. Alright, he's just about done. Say goodnight, Gracie. Yeah, that, uh, that's it. I think we're done, you guys. <laughs> That wasn't so bad, really. All things considered, that wasn't so bad at all. Um, we might even try this for 14. Uh, hopefully by that time I can upgrade these blocks to the next level. I know we need to get bricks uh, to do that. But yeah, I mean, I think maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll do this uh, for Horde 14 as well. But I do believe we're finished. What do we got in here? Some peas. How about we eat those right now? And some more bullets for the 9 mil, so that's not so bad. Yeah, I'm going to stay... I want to stay close to... the horde base. Just in case, but I'm pretty sure... it's all over. Okay. There's a bird's nest out here. Nice. Well, um, I guess we could go do our quest. Oh, uh, here. Let me touch these up. Everything's in really good shape here. That didn't take any damage at all. Um, did they... There was a little bit of banging going on in here, but... Let's just look. I need to get a, 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 a gas can for that. I need to start carrying a gas can around. I know I keep saying that, but I keep forgetting to do it when I get back to the base. There was a little bit of hit on that, but otherwise, yeah. Uh, I can't repair that right at the moment. It's looking good. Well, uh, all right. So, oh, you know what? We have a an infection problem, actually. That is the first thing we need to deal with. So, I guess I'm going to run around and look for some stumps and see if we can get some honey. Uh, because I got infected when I was working off camera, so I had to take... And I was able to make one honey, but I had to take that, of course. So, uh, what do we need for that? I think we need, we need five, yeah, we need five honeycombs. All right, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to start looking around for some stumps uh, to make some honey because we got to deal with this infection and we have to deal with it pretty quick because it's at, already at 3.8%. Um, so let me do that. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'll, I'll keep the camera going. But if nothing camera worthy happens between now and the morning. Oh man, I, I thought that was honey at first. I'm going, oh, we're saved. Um, I'll probably just wait and bring you guys back in the morning and then we'll see where we're at. I suppose the other thing we could do is try and. Okay, here's a stump. Let's get our axe. We could try and just go do the quest and maybe we'll luck out and loot some honey inside of it. I don't know. Let's see how much honeycomb we get out of this. We got three pieces. Okay, so if we could find just one more stump, we might be okay. And while we're out and about looking for stuff, we can get some eggs too. And uh, run across a rabbit or three or... Oh, we don't want to run across a wolf. There's a wolf right over there. Could even be a dire wolf. So let's go this way. We don't have the firepower to kill something like that right now. Not on foot, anyway. Oh, that looks a little scary, too. There's a couple more yucca plants. Let's grab those. We can make stuff with that. There's a ton of mailboxes here. Okay, schematic for an iron shovel. Yes, indeed. Thank you. We need an iron shovel to make a well. Oh, shit. Uh. 
Yeah, we need an iron shovel to make a well. You guys were telling me that in the comments. So we got that done. Oh! I thought I heard something. We, we actually have enough books to make the research station now, too. I uh, have found a couple more in trash just as a... Oh, crap, there's a sleeper right there. Right there. Okay. Shh. Don't make any... Don't step on that. Can I pick these... Uh, uh, can I pick these up? No. Wow. Mailboxes are the place for books, I guess, huh? Okay. Um... We really need to find that last stump before we get to 5% on our infection or we're going to, it's going to escalate. So let's be looking for a stump. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. This is not good. I don't know if those are blood moon zombs or... Yeah, they're still coming after me. Okay, hopefully there's not a bunch of them. We're only getting one or two. We can handle them right here, but if we get a ton of them, we're in trouble. Get some bleed on you and some thumping. Nice. Nice solid connection there. Oh shit, we got a dog. I hope that dog doesn't decide to jump the thing. You know, I think for you. And we put the hurt on him. Whew. All right, where is my repair hammer? Repair hammer, repair hammer. Wherefore art thou? There you are. My eyeballs were not seeing it. Okay, that wolf is close. One more shock and blast, and he's toast. And uh, he'll provide some goodies for us, too. Whilst we're here... Um, oh, shoot. We're at 5.2%. All right, now we're in trouble. <laughs> Damn it, Jim. Now we're in trouble on the honey. Uh, or on the infection. Uh, what to do? Well, maybe we just go do our quest and maybe we'll luck out and find some antibiotics or something that's unfortunate that is unfortunate uh, all right well i'll tell you what before we do that i want to kind of see if that wolf's gonna come back before we go out and about and get surprised by him so let's grab those books and this paper and we're going to make ourselves a research desk. Uh, where do we do that at? Oh, do we do that in our own inventory? Yeah, okay. Our research station. And this is going to open up um, some next level stuff for us that we really desperately need. Okay, cool. So we'll put this in here. It's possible that the trader might have an antibiotic. I don't remember how much those cost. I think they're kind of kind of expensive, but um, we gotta do so we're gonna have to do something. Okay, so let's put that back in there. Those can go in there. Um, actually, this is kind of like my makeshift light, so we're gonna keep that for now. Uh, let's put this stuff back in here. 
Either that or we luck out and find enough stumps for me to make two honeys. And we have to do that before we hit 10%. So that's another option too. It's just a little dangerous right now, you know, running around out in the out in the tulies. I'm going to make... Uh, we don't have any meat. How are we doing on food? Not so good. Let's. We better just make some eggs. And we'll make a little yucca too. Okay, so that can go in there. Stones can go in here. We'll keep the small stones for throwing. Uh, this is forge stuff. Forge, firewood. Actually, here, let's just put the firewood in here for now. Feathers in here. Okay, let's do a sort. Uh, we don't need to carry all those bone knives with us. And you, we can't, you can't scrap bone knives in UDL, so let's get rid of that. Just trying to clear up a little space here. We'll put the battery in here for now, I guess. And here we go. Okay, so we finally got our station. And we're going to put it... Uh, I guess we'll put it right here. All right. Now, what's the next most important thing that we need to do? Artisan's table. Uh, blacksmith's forge. Well, we just... Uh, furnace. We got mechanic's table. We can make a bicycle with that. But each one of the... Well, not each one of them. Some of these... Oh, that's research station too. Okay, so... All of these look like they need 200 research points. And we currently have... Uh, where do I have that at? Somewhere I have research points. I have 50. So we're going to need to find three schematics that we don't know or don't care about to get the first 200 points. Okay, so that's what we're going to start working towards. All right, let's grab that. We get, uh, oh, we get 10 food from these. That's not bad, actually. So why don't we eat three, and then we'll save the other two. Put those down there. And a yucca juice. Let's take that right now just to top off our hydration. And it's morning, too. That is fantastic. That is fantastic. Okay, we're going to keep the jars with us. Um, I'm going to... We don't need to carry, like I said, all of these kniffies. Let's do this. Let's put a couple of those... Uh, two of those back. We will take the mod off of here and put it onto here. Get rid of that. Seriously, game, you're sending a wandering horde after me at the end of Horde Night. What kind of bull crap is that? Oh, scrap iron. Oh, this is not good. This is actually not good. Um, okay. Here, let's put that there and get it upgraded. Uh, where the heck? I got... I got my stones. I uh, put my stones away. Okay, so this is like Horde Night number two. Oh, no, it's Horde Morning. That's what this is. This is Horde Morning, you guys. In case you've never had a Horde Morning well, now you now you know what it looks like. You bastards! Oh, nice hit. Edgar, go away. I need to get a... Try and get a bleed on Edgar without him hitting us in the legs here. Go away, Steve. I guess we're not going to be using our back door anymore. <laughs> oh, shit. I was afraid that was going to happen. Okay. Damn it, Jim. I can't reach him. All right, here. You know what? Take that. Okay, Edgar. You need to come over here. Oh, shit. Here he comes. Come over here where I can get to you. There you go. Take a bleed. 
Take a shotgun blast. Take another. This guy's tough. Conk. 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 Oh, no. Let's refresh your bleed. And refresh your conk. There. He's had a refreshed conk. Whew. Okay, that was fun. That was fun. You might, we might as well leave that there. Uh, even though it's hard to get to the zombos from that. Um, here's another good argument for why I put a hatch in the doorway instead of a block. Um, for the individual that was telling me that I'm using an exploit by putting a hatch in the door. Okay. Um, <laughs> it's too, if you use a block, you can't get to them. So there you go. Um, all right. So you guys, we are kind of in bad shape with this infection. Uh, we are not going to get to, we're not going to get to the, the quest today. We're going to have to do that in the next episode. But what I am going to do is I'm going to grab a couple of things from here. Uh, let's grab all of this. And we're going to run over to the trader. Do I have my money too? Yeah. And and just see if we, oh, what is what do we have that's so heavy? It's the iron. You know what? We might be able to, here, we don't need that any longer. Uh, we can put these back too. Okay, so put this back. I already have one battery, I think, in here. So we'll see if we can sell that other battery. And let's run over there and see if there's a snowball's chance in hell that he happens to have a, an antibiotic for sale, A, and B, that we actually have enough money to buy it. If that doesn't work, then we could still possibly do this if we can very quickly find a few more stumps. Yes, I know. I should have closed it. He's still hanging around. Okay. Uh, take a look at your inventory. So sell you all of this. Uh, sell that. Sell these. Sell these. That's right. Really, the someone's bath. coming because I left the door open. Okay. Wow, oh, sounds like a lot of someone's. All right, uh, meds, meds. Where's your meds? I don't uh, consumables. That's food. Oh man, do you not have any anti? He doesn't have any antibiotics, you guys. Oh, okay. Do you have any honey? Oh, he's got honey. Okay. Um, so let's buy that, and let's uh, let's eat it. Now we just have to come up with five more honeycombs. So that, that'll start reducing, that'll start reducing the infection, but it's not going to clear it all the way up. So we're going to run out into the woods here. We have three honeycombs back at the base. If we can just get two more then uh, before the honey runs out. Cause see right now it's, um, let's look here. Where's the status thingy? Treated mild infection. So it's start it's starting it should be going down. It's seven point four percent right now. But the problem is is it'll stop at two point four percent or whatever. Yeah, see now it's seven point three if unless we get another dose. So we could maybe get get this done. We just need another stump and we need to make sure we don't get et in the process. Okay. Are there any stumps within view? We don't want to go too far that way. Oh, I uh, there's something else I wanted to tell you guys. I don't think we're actually playing on the map that I th thought I had create. Well, that I did create for this series. And the reason I don't think that is because I don't remember anywhere where there was wasteland to the east of the forest biome. And the other reason I think that is because when I went to start the game, it looked like it recreated 
a, a whole new map again, and I don't know why or... Oh, crap. I don't know what I did wrong with that. So, we might just be on a completely... Uh, shit. Zombies all over. Uh, be on a map that... Um, that I'm not familiar with, which is which is okay because you know then we then we can discover everything. But come on, stump! Seriously, there's not a single stump anywhere in this area, huh? Because I think I think you can spot the stumps from further out even before like the grass and all the other stuff renders in. Maybe, maybe not. Let's just go this way. Let's just go this way. We got a little bit of time now. Well, we're getting a lot of eggs. My goodness. Well, bird's nest, I should say. Okay, here's a stump. All right. Uh, let's get our axe. Just need two pieces of honey game. And we get one. <laughs> Oh, I love it. It's just it's just the way it goes, isn't it? Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, keep looking. We got to find another stump. We got to find another stump. Stumpity, stumpity, stumpity dump. I like it when these mods put the eggs in the nest because they're a little bit easier to spot. Uh, I believe Ravenhurst does that too, and maybe a couple of the other ones. I don't want to mess with... Well, I don't want to mess with any zombies right now, but especially not Edgar. Okay, let's go over to this side. Can you believe that? I told the game we needed two, and it gave us one. What a slap in the face, man. What a slap in the face. Yeah, there's some pain pills and a bone. Who wouldn't want pain pills and a bone? Ah, there's a stump. That just, that almost looked like it appeared out of nowhere. Okay, there's the rest of the honey that we need. So let's go back home, get this honey made up, and then we will have... Did, did we already loot that? Yeah. We will have taken care of our infection problem. Okay, let's grab the other honeycomb and grab... Uh, oh, I guess we have a jar with us already. And then cook that up. And let's take this honey, and we should be good. Okay. Oh, getting hit by zombies or animals will make an infection worse. Oh, yeah, okay, so we don't want to get hit. Uh, but we should be good now. Uh, it still takes a while for it you know, to, to wear down, but we've, we never got to 10%, and we have treated it with 10% worth of medicine. Honey, to be precise, so we're good. Okay, you guys, uh, it is that is it for this episode. So basically, um, we're going to start the next episode by going uh, and doing our next quest. And I'm probably going to wait until our infection is completely done so we don't get hit and increase it. And maybe in the meanwhile, I might cut some wood or just harvest some resources. So uh, that is the plan. Thanks, guys, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We had a successful Horde Night 7. We are definitely going to be looking now for uh, research data as we continue on here in the play in the playthrough. Uh, that's going to be super high priority. And, yeah, so that's it. So, again, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Could I have said that any faster? I don't know. We'll have to try next time. Bye.